Hi everyone, I hope you are all doing well. So let's see what is coming through for you. What do you need to know right now? So I'm going to start with some messages from the person on your mind. So please think about someone and straight away I have. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. I have, I want to feel that way again. I left you before you could leave me. I hid who I really am from you and I am grateful for the spiritual lesson. Okay, so some of you could be dealing with somebody from the past. It could be a past energy, an ex, somebody that you had a fight, argument, going for a separation. Uh, but so for some of you, this is somebody that you have not been involved romantically or somebody that is about to come your way or maybe somebody that you already know, but you're just in, in fr friendly terms, if I can say that. Now, uh, but just know that this person is thinking about you regardless if you're... Uh, separation or in as in um, friendly terms whatever the situation is at the moment for you this person is thinking about you and they really want to feel like everything is okay between you two and um just as i mentioned before for some of you you are in separation at the moment and i feel like you are dealing in some cases with somebody who was um, you're very insecure so they just felt like as soon as you had some sort of problem instead of working on the problem to sort it out I felt like I feel like they were kind of running away because they just have uh, low self-esteem and they just feel like they have to run away and uh, for some of you this person just pretended to be something that they are not or someone that they are not so maybe they were lying to you you know, the, I feel like there was some sort of deception for some of you. But uh, overall, this person is very grateful for the fact that they met you. And even, you know, if you are just their friends or just, you know, somebody from their community, they are happy that they met you when they met you. Okay, so I'm going to pull the zodiac sign and see with who you could be dealing. Or oh, this could also be your energy or your zodiac sign so we have Aquarius okay so I'm going to pull the tarot cards and see let's clarify those cards okay so let's see oops a daisy these cards have a mind of their own today okay so I have the Hierophant in reverse I have the seven of wands Two of Cups in reverse, okay. Then I have Two of Swords in reverse, and then I have the Six of Swords. Okay, so what I'm getting so far is that for some of you, uh, just as I mentioned before, you um, you are dealing with somebody who is very traditional, okay, but maybe they're just not feeling right for you, or maybe you, you were dealing with this person, so maybe they had certain um, unconventional lifestyle or something that will not suit you so for example the way they were living their life maybe the way they're doing something like their job or there was just something that just did not make you feel right or comfortable with that uh with the um, seven of wands i feel like um you are standing up for what you believe and that's absolutely fine so you are fighting for your rights you're standing your ground again that's absolutely fine you're being very defensive but for some of you i feel like this person if they did something you find out about that I feel like they were very defensive and they did not want to um, come forward and admit the truth, especially with I hid who I really am from you. So there was some sort of secrets that I feel like you find out. Um, um, just as I mentioned, for some of you, there has been uh, some sort of um, deception and I feel like uh, your relationship was very unbalanced. You know, So for example, you could also be dealing or you were dealing with somebody who was hot and cold, uh, maybe this was a certain cycle uh, that went on and on. So uh, everything was okay and then all of a sudden this person will pull their energy back. So I would say this is more of a situationship. Uh, so for example, this person will talk to you only when they will want to and otherwise um, they will just try to get their attention from you just to kind of make themselves feel better. Uh, and then they just pull their energy back, which obviously is not a nice thing to do. Now again, with the two of swords in reverse, again, I feel like there has been some sort of delays or there are some sort of delays. I feel like if you're in a separation, I feel like you are going to still take some more time just to kind of 
think things through uh, if you want to take this person back or not. Uh, but uh, again, just as I mentioned before, some of you are going to find out something. Just see the things as they really are. And uh, with the Six of Swords, I feel like this person will come forward to kind of, if you had an argument or a separation, if you're in separation, I feel like they will come forward, but they will wait for the water to calm down, if that makes sense, uh, because they can see progress, uh, you know, they can see the potential of this relationship, and they want to make things work again, and they want things to kind of move forward with you, but they just are waiting for things to, or for the water to come down, if I can say that, because uh, they just feel that if they will come forward, right now is not the best thing to do for them at the moment so depending of what happened between you two they just know they really mess it up and they just want to basically uh, wait for the right timing and if this is not somebody that you had uh, an argument or uh, continuously cycle uh, if this is somebody new again they just are waiting for the right time to come forward to express their feelings towards you if that makes sense so um that is all I'm seeing. I really hope this reading helped. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon in another video. Bye!